I'm Dr. Peter Panagotakos. I'm a board certified dermatologist and I've been practicing dermatology at my present location at 2001 Union Street for the past 40 years. My motto in my practice is that I believe every man and woman should know something can be done about hair loss, both medically and surgically. Low level laser light goes down into the cells of the hair follicle, stimulating the cell to grow, stopping apoptosis, which is where destruction of the hair where it's dying, and stimulating ATP and causing regrowth of these hairs. Well, now you have a hair that's dying, that's decided to stop dying and start regrowing. Well, the regrowth was phenomenal. It was much better than what we were seeing with minoxidil. And after that, I started using low-level laser light on some of my patients. Low-level laser light was very popular for people, particularly women, going into these hair salons and sitting under what looked like hair dryers. Or they'd go to a doctor's office and they'd sit for a half hour, three, four times a week. When you consider you have to drive to a salon or to a doctor's office and then sit for this half hour or so for the therapy or perhaps even longer, depending on what the unit is, compliance is rather poor. When the design of a cap came into being where you could have these diodes just an inch away from the scalp and light could be put on and the patient could do it whenever they wanted to. Most of my patients now do it in the evening. They're sitting around reading and they do it when they get home. It can be used uh, putting it on and just getting into the routine and driving it to, while you're using driving to work because the therapy is generally 15 minutes to a half hour, three, four times a week. The compliance there has been phenomenal because it's, it's easy. The Capella's cap is a, I think, a great unit that uh, has taken these low-level laser lights and put them in a cap that's very sturdy, works well. And today, I think it's probably the top of the line, the Cadillac of the ways of delivering uh, light to the scalp. And yes, I would recommend this cap to my patients.